All right, welcome everybody to another episode of my For Glory series. Now, here's the thing: I haven't done For Glory in a while because, like, I'm like really stinky about Wi-Fi in general. Like, it just kind of just throws me off sometimes. Like, I'm just, I don't know, I'm too picky with my food sometimes, and in terms of Smash, but not really food. Um, okay, so in this occasion, I'm going to be playing Cloud because obviously everybody wants to, you know, see what Cloud is. What's up? You know, the reason I got hit by that is because. I approached and I expected him to like block, but he just launched it at me and I was like, okay, that's kind of weird. Generally, somebody will like charge a projectile but not necessarily throw it right away. Um, one of my favorite tools with Cloud is the Side B. So Side B does 19 damage and it kinda, you can just kind of use it at a run. So you can punish things at medium range with ease. So that's really comfortable. And it kind of feels like Dancing Blade as a Marth in Brawl where you can just punish anything with it. It kind of just works. And also, if you if you like catch people jumping back to the stage with forty, you can just like spike them. It's really easy. And upper is like the goat for like juggling of any type. And if people stand up from the ledge normally, just force smash and reaction. What I did there, and then they just they just die. They just explode off the side. It's it's kind of just crazy. Like like goddamn dude. So now we're up against like, Link. Now I this is like the first time I ever done this matchup. It was also kind of laggy, but like, I didn't really like, I didn't really understand how to play because it's like, am I supposed to approach? Am I supposed to like run and block and then punish? I could have narrowed that. Um, or am I supposed to like camp with limit and then my projectiles would beat that? I decided to approach just because you know I wanted to like see how Cloud can deal with projectiles in general. Um, I dash deck there because dash deck is just too much priority. Oh my god, he was dead. He was dead. He was super dead. But I tried to style with him and and spike him and I ended up saving him. So. Dumb me, dumb me, but that's fine. I like using Cloud's downer to land into people because if people try to attack you as you're landing, your downer will just beat whatever they're doing and then you'll just kill them. So I threw the force smash in, but then he ended up fast falling to kind of just dodge the hit, but then he ended up just dying for it. Happens a lot, I mean, it's, it's kind of common. He tried to like edge guard me, but he was way too slow about it. At this point, I'm just trying to like jump above his stuff and then punish him on the ground. Not working out too well. If you get forwarded on the ground, I think you want a shield. I don't think you can follow it up right away. Maybe you can dump him. I tried to jab and it didn't seem like fast enough. From zero at least. Maybe the spike one will be different. I'm trying to save my meter to use it on down B. At some point, I got tired of that. But I'm just trying to dancing around neutral, kind of figure out how to get into him. Kind of just understand my character's tools as well. I mean, Cloud hasn't been out for too long, so you have to like kind of come up with strategies on the on the on the fray, pretty much. Had to use my up B for meter. Not too sh not too good, but hey, man, we'll come back. At this point, I can just safely charge it. I mean, Link isn't really gonna kill me off the stage, so whatever. I wish I could have grabbed that and then I would have back, uh, back throw. It would have been much better. He's gonna jump. He doesn't jump, so that's good. Throw my neutral B to cover the ledge. I was gonna force smash that, but he ended up forwarding like at a good angle. Dash like that. I could have side B too for more damage. I think that would have been better. I think in general you wanna punish things with side B. Barely missed my down B. Force Smash will just kill him from the other side of the stage because he Force Smash just doesn't care at all whatsoever. I'm just trying to realize he speaks in Japanese. So here we are in the first Cloud Ditto. <laughs> of course we're going to get a Cloud Ditto. He taunts, so I just don't really charge my meter too much. I'm approaching. At this point, I'm kind of just filling out the other Cloud player. Like, okay, are they going to no chiller? Are they going to down tilt? Are they going to block? Are they going to spam side B? Like, what is this guy going to do? Down throw side B is a really good idea because if people jump or air it out, you get them with a side B. Uh, people can can hit you out of it though, so that's one thing. That's fun. I'm just kind of just running in and punishing his positioning with side B. He neutral gets up. I could have run a force smash that, but obviously doing everything on Wi-Fi is a little too hard. But that would have been the optimal punish. Switch spot down, I almost kill him. And upper just murder him. Cloud has a lot of strength. I like this. I like playing this character a lot. He feels really nice in your hands. And he, he's very rewarding. Like, if you're, you're playing good, he's really rewarding. And I like that a lot. I'm trying to frame trap him into down tilt, neutral air upper. Finally get my neutral air upper combo. 
up tilt miss from behind me that made no sense i would expect up tilt to have good range from behind cloud but it kind of doesn't for good just one thing that's really good about cloud is that he's down air just kind of just beats everything it's like length's down air kind of but even better it has more range or something it's just it's just mad good for like no real reason got him with down b but he needed just a little bit more percent for me to finish him off and he gets me with his own down b and of course i freaking die on 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 the spot which happens all the time Okay, he could he should have up he should have up here after that. Now at this point I just spiked him three times, so I'm gonna charge something. Because at that point I keep hitting him in the air. And I, I kinda have a feeling that he would just try to dodge just because he doesn't wanna die. He wants to be safe, quote unquote. So me doing that charge attack, kinda just murder then. Okay, next second cloud ditto. I don't know if he changed his attack to smile. I don't know then. Side B is so good. It does so much damage. It's so convenient. It comes out so fast. It has so much priority. So much speed. It's like one, it's literally one of the best moves in the game. Like I will kill for Sheik to have that. Like imagine Sheik had a side B. Cloud side B does a punish, dude. That would be so rad. I would be so cool. I'm trying to like spike them at this point, but I kind of just missed twice. I just find I'm jumping a lot. I don't know why I'm jumping a lot. I don't like it too much. Okay, he's just air dodging my stuff. I should just jump and bait it. I, what I did that's what I did right there. I just I knew he was gonna like jump maybe air dodge, maybe not So I just waited for him and I forced smash him and land it. So that's convenient I think I should have up there. I should have down tilt up there. I keep trying to go for neutraler At this point, I'm just trying to down tilt him I decide to go for I, I was like I'm gonna save it, but then I was like here's 30 damage real quick if I just take it at this point, I can kill him. I try to aim with downer, barely miss. Try to force so much to get up. At this point, I'm just like trying to space him out. I miss. I miss my B reverse neutral B twice. I could have up B that, actually. You can use your neutral B to cover him on the ledge. At this point, I can just up air or anything. Anything will kill him pretty much. Throw a force so much just because why the hell not? Should spot downer would kill him. And weak upper, weak upper, weak upper kills them. Got them. Okay, Mario. I was kind of excited for this matchup because I was like, okay, I think I think Cloud can wreck Mario kinda. He just has the range and just the priority to just not give a damn about Mario. Yeah, like if Mario is not careful at all, he can just get wrecked. Kinda, pretty much. At this point, I'm just kind of just spacing him out. I just thought he should be a dead Mario. I went way too deep for that. I could I could have positioned myself way better for that one. Like he should have that situation. He should have died. I should have got a hit. Should have just backed him properly or just up smash him or force smash him even. I should have I should have definitely frame trapped that upper. I should have upper. I should have fast fall and then upper and then cover the landing with down smash or force smash or something. I could have played that much better, much more precise honestly. I should have side B him honestly. Like just take the if you have free damage, just take it, because why not? Like a free damage is always good, honestly. I try to I try to go way to style it. And force the match would just kill him, which is ridiculous. Okay, second match against Mario. So the thing about this is that I'm at this point I'm kinda just more used to the Mario matchup. Now this guy hasn't really grabbed me or anything yet. Now when Mario started juggling me, I'm like, okay, what what do I do? Do I air dodge? Do I neutral air? What do I do? And then he force smash, and I'm like, okay, I don't know why you will force smash, but okay. And at that point, I'm just like, all right, just space him out. Because against Mario, you want to just outrange him. Mario doesn't have that much damage, like kind of like range. Okay, he's off the stage. He double jumps back or dead. Okay, had he not side B that, he would have died. He gets up from the ledge with a get up attack. I just walk away, good enough amount that I can just force smash that and then get an easy KO. That was just reaction. I didn't want to roll there, it just accidentally roll. Force smash does 17 damage. I should have definitely sure hop up there, beat the fireball, and then juggle him after. I spawn I'm just waiting. I want him to like throw something. And then I react to that and then I throw the neutral B.
Yeah, just side B that punish. Side B punish is just too good. It's too much damage. It's too much damage. Keeps your moves fresh. And it's kind of just everything you want, really. Like, kind of honestly. <coughs> well, he's not doing anything, so I'm just going to charge my meter. Then he decides to approach. And then he does that, so I'm just screw that. Charging my meter. <laughs> LOL. And then I wasted it for no reason. Smart zero. Smart. Could have up smash. Could have up beat. Could have reverse up beat. And he would have killed died. <coughs> And then he down and up so it's not a combo, but I just jumped because I felt safe. Anyway. I have a feeling he's gonna get up normally. So I just up smash, but that, that's so sorry. And then he jumps, so I just order. He jumped fireball really unsafely. Just reacted to that, just got him with order. Not too bad. Third match against Mario. Alright. Boom boom. Keep out keep him out of range with Saibi. We already talked about that. If anything, grab here and there, down throw side B, really good frame trap. I, I knew he was gonna grab me, so I just rolled away out of that. I waited for him to move, then I tried to go for a grab. I tried to hold down and then and then uh, shield. That works with Sheik when you're at zero, but it didn't work with Cloud. Maybe it does if you have meter. He, again, he did the exact same thing, jump with a fireball, then I just punish him with order. He jumped at the wrong range. Get that. He jumps above me. At this point, I'm just trying to cover the landings. I, I, I'm kind of getting his shield habits like like down to a T, so like I can kind of understand when he's going to block and when he's not, so I can just throw moves at the right times. Forder, force him to air dodge, punish, get up, get a charge, force smash, almost died. Try to punish with downer. I should have knew he, I should have knew he was gonna up smash and then just back air or something. Like punishing that was really easy. Block that, punish. I thought like he was gonna land behind me. You can just land it with downer, it's really safe. And then he jumps fireball again. Puts himself in range of down B. I see him that he does something just down B right away dead. Not too not too complicated. Okay, we have another cloud ditto. Against Is that a is that a little phase like U V U? Is that a phase? Okay. Probably. Oh well, he neutral is very unsafe, like I can just down throw side B down pretty seriously. Cover his landing. He dashed out. I mean he down tilts. At this point I notice he's not grabbing, so I can just block around. As you can tell, just walking around. Jump, wait for the wait for the side B. I went way too off, so he just kills me because of the LB, whatever. I'm like, alright, whatever. I can be in the neutral, so I'm just gonna win this match. Is what I'm thinking. Juggle him slightly. He tried to upper me, but then I just downer. The thing about downer is that downer beats upper, but it b loses to waiting. Creates a mix-up game. You can just bait it out. Sometimes they'll downer, sometimes they won't. Kind of like that. Air dodge you seems like a bad option in the dead Okay, jump above his attack. I'm kind of not doing too much upper right now because I have a feeling he'll just... Uh, so he wastes his meter right away. I just blocked. I was like, I'm just going to wait. I, I was scared of him doing uh, doing down B because that could have killed me at that percent. And then he kind of just... He got really scared or something. He just made a mistake or something, but I guess he just killed himself. So, whatever. All right, we have a Mega Man. Mega Man. Okay, at this point in, with Mega Man, I'm just thinking to myself, okay, I've never fought a character like this. Uh, I'm guessing I have to approach. I'm guessing I have to fight him. The match was really laggy, so I kept getting hit by four smash just all throughout the match at the random points. Like, like sometimes you'll get him, you'll see me hit get hit by some really dumb four smashes. But uh, I'm just thinking to myself, okay, I wanted to do this instead. Well, like, shit or that, but then I just get hit because, like, I don't know. It, you know when it's laggy sometimes and you feel, like, just clumsy? It was, like, what that of a match. Take the damage, like I talked earlier. Just want to take some damage from here and there on. At this point, I mean, he's not really it's outspacing me or anything. So at this point, I'm kind of just throwing moves. It's kind of just force smashing. He recovered in a way that was like, like just not too safe. I mean, he recovered like far away. At uh, that point, I'm thinking, okay, just air dodge through it. And then he just shot it really late. And he shots another one for like no reason. And then he shots another one. And then he goes for another one. Like this man sat there and shot like 24 smashes. At this point, I'm thinking, I just want to force smash him. Back air dad. He's going to jump. I'm thinking he's going to jump. Then I go for a downer and miss it like a scrub. Up smash, just roll away. Waste my meter for no reason. And then I upper. I'm like, I have to upper again. And I get it. And then we out. Oh, that was cool. I didn't die at the end. 
at this point i'm thinking to myself dude first captain falcon i get let's go just want to wreck this falcon real quick i dashed that because i have a feeling he was gonna go for grab or dash stack both moves i can beat with just dash stack at this point he's landing like that something like maybe he'll 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 down b or something and again hey that's 21 damage i'm like what the hell at this point i can just i could just punish him like this he, go, he recovers low that's that's smart that's very smart I'm waiting for that double jump. Go for the force smash. He super dies. Force smash is just ridiculous. And then I, I mash my B button, so I just wasted my meter again. I was kind of mad at that. I tried to go for uh, landing forward into into Dante. Didn't work. And then he kills himself. So that was pretty quick. I was like, God damn it! I wanted to edge guard you at least once, like spike you or something. And yet another cloud ditto. Another. Okay, this man is down tilting, so I'm thinking, okay, he's not really grabbing, he's trying to punish my, he's trying to wait for me to punish, and then just punish dad with down tilt, so I'm like, okay, if I don't make any first moves, then this guy should, like, like, his play style should, like, fall through. I like Cloud's no chill be a lot, which is really good. I wish I would have gotten that spike. He could have killed me here, but he backed away for no reason. He force smash, back throw, get him off the stage. And then just touch his forder, jump away, tip a forder him, and then he just dies. Neutral, neutral B into upper sometimes works. At this point, I'm just juggling him, covering landings, going pretty go. Cool. Uh, I wanted him to get neutral get up so bad. I'm like, okay, I'll charge that too. He goes for side B. He kind of just wasted it around. There was no reason to use it. He's pretty much at kill percent right now, so I just have to. I try to bait at him, and then I just up B him off the stage, cause why not? All right, I was like really interested in this one because I got Pikachu. I was like, hmm, I have a few ideas how Cloud can play this. You can kind of just uh, wait around for for up B, and then you can punish it out of shield with side B. You can punish for it on blocks. So I have to roll away from there. If he quick as quicks attack, I can like block it or run away from it on side B. I can also no chiller. It has no lag. I was like, huh, I have some really good tools to fight Pikachu, I was thinking. And I have so much damage, and my moves hit low, so I can punish Pikachu, actually. Like, down tail, side B. Like, Cloud could seem to contest Pikachu in some ways. He's also heavy and doesn't die early. He has a poor recovery, so that'd be, like, the only thing that Pikachu can kind of, like, crap on him for. I was like, oh, yeah, that's not too bad. I was thinking, at least. Trying to bait it out. You can't punish side B, so don't, I mean, forward, so don't even try. There you go. I neutraler that. I, I waited for him. I, I thought he was going to either neutral get up or roll into me. So I just waited there and force smashed him. He ended up going rolling towards me. It's not too bad. Almost got him with that force smash. He would have super died. Boom, boom. Got full meter and he kills himself for no reason. And, and yeah, that will pretty much just conclude the episode for today. <laughs> oh my god. Hopefully you guys enjoyed For Glory with Cloud with me. I may do more For Glory with Cloud. Maybe more videos with Cloud. We'll see, man. We never know. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you guys in another video. Zero out.